What is going on guys, Powerful Sway, it's him bringing you guys a Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League video. If you'd like to see, please consider liking and subscribing, it helps me out tremendously. And I just want to say, um, this video is going to be a positive video about Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League, so if you're not into that, feel free to click off, leave a dislike, or a hateful comment, it doesn't bother me. Um, anyways, so, let's talk about what we're going to talk about today, and this is why I basically think Season 4 will be the best season for Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. Now, we can only assume that Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League will have 4 seasons seasons just from the information we know but what is exactly coming in season four well we're going to get right into that and that's going to be the return of batman and most likely the return of superman and wonder woman as well and also to deathstroke as a playable character so basically rock said he's saving all of the best stuff for the last season now maybe this game gets a year two maybe this game gets future content we really don't know but judging from as of now, as of October 24th, as I'm making this video, we can only assume that season four will be the last season. Now, something about Suicide Squad, which a lot of people do not like to point out, which I think is entirely true in my opinion, and it's just pretty obvious, the game has gotten better each season. It's just something people do not want to admit online. Season zero, I will say, was an absolutely was just an absolute dumpster fire but it was a lot of fun um you know but the mutators and the way the game had to be played with the crazed it just wasn't fun and you were forced to play a certain way same thing with season one episode one which was a scarecrow season it was terrible but the game started to get slightly better as seasons um, went on like two-face episode was great season one episode two and then season two was a good step in the right direction it's just no one liked it because miss freeze was um, I, I don't even know what to really call it, but you guys have seen what everyone has said online about Miss Freeze. And so far, season three has been the best season of Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League with Lawless and the Catwoman themed gear. Lawless is not my favorite character, but I've seen a lot of positive um, from people talking about Lawless and how she plays. And season three is my favorite season. The mutators are cool. Um, the gear, like the, the gear, like the Catwoman gear set is the best gear set in the game, hands down. Like, it's not even close. Like, you can tell they actually thought about making this gear set, and it was a really well thought out and just really good gear set. And um, being able to rescue Green Lantern and sort of those build-up missions, although brief, um, it's just a step in the right direction. Now, it, which makes me, it makes me positive and look forward to Season 4 because we know that, hey, Deathstroke's going to be playable, and Batman's returning, Superman's returning, and Wonder Woman is likely returning in Season 4. So there's going to be a lot rolling with Season 4. Obviously, I know who the infamous characters will be gear-wise in Season 4, but I'm not really sure if I'm allowed to mention that on a YouTube video. But um, just seeing how the game has progressed, obviously, you know, the Steam player count is still going to be 100 when Season 4 drops. Let's just be real. Um, but... And another, like, other things to point out, too, like, is the game has gotten, like, a little bit better as each season this came out. Like, we get better outfits, better battle pass, better weapons, just everything gets a little bit better. Like, season zero, I would, I would have to rank, like, a three out of ten. Season one is, like, a five out of ten. Season two is, like, a six, and then I would say season three is, like, a seven out of ten, eight out of ten. So it's like they're taking small steps to get better, which just it just makes me excited and hopeful for season four, which is why, like I'm telling y'all today, I think season four will be the best season. It'll probably be a lot of fun with the Brainiac boss fights, with Deathstroke being a playable character, having you know the Justice League return, and most likely taking down that final Brainiac. And then I can only assume the gear sets are going to be crazy. You know, I look forward to that. The gear is going to be crazy. It's going to be a lot of fun playing and farming. Um, gear and resources with your friends and we can't even mention like forget to mention like medieval metropolis from what we've seen we don't know much about medieval metropolis but from what we've seen it looks insane from what i've heard from like different sources it is the best map in the game the best elseworlds map and i know it's just going to be fun to explore sort of like arkham you know or gotham in season three it's been so much fun and a great change of pace being in Gotham rather than, you know, just the same old Metropolis we had in Season 1 and Season 2. Um, nothing wrong with that. You know, it was cool having the Jokerified world, but they could have done a lot better. Same thing with Season 2. They could have done 
a lot better. But I will say, Frozen Metropolis was a bit better. But then moving on to season three, seeing Gotham, going back to the asylum, going back to all these historic landmarks. Hopefully they expand upon that in episode six. But obviously we'll have to wait and see. But I've heard that, you know, medieval Metropolis is absolutely crazy. And I've heard such great things about, like, Deathstroke, what his traversal is going to be. Obviously, we can only assume that Deathstroke, you know, he's not going to have probably too much difference between them because most characters play the same in Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League but you know it's just gonna be cool to play as Deathstroke and seeing how like not only has the shop gotten better as the seasons have gone on the battle pass has gotten better um it really gives me that feel like Rock City's gonna go all out for this final season of season four you know bringing in Deathstroke Batman returning Superman returning and it's just gonna be cool to see like you know from start to finish, like, hey, we killed the Justice League, and although their, you know, rescue has been brief, it's going to be cool to see them all back for that final season and being able to take down that final Brainiac, and it's just going to be a lot of fun from a player's perspective, and hopefully, you know, a few things I would like to see them add for season four that can make the season even better. I would love a trading system of some sort. And then expanding the amount of weapons we can hold on to just to make it a little bit better for season four because obviously episode six as most of you guys know is going to be a redux season so we're going to have old gear coming back that'll be probably revamped and different so it's like and obviously the stash is glitched so they need to fix the stash um but you know just a ton of different things obviously i don't really know how this game is going to conclude and i think that's what has me the most excited because i know we're going to get a sequel which is weird to even think about because this game is financially one of the biggest flops of all time, but somehow, some way, Rock City has been able to survive and live to fight another day. But, you know, I look so forward to season four, just seeing how the game has grown. Obviously, online people, you know, are going to say the game hasn't improved. And yes, from like a fundamental standpoint, the game hasn't really improved. It's still the same concept. I'm not denying that. I'm not trying to say that. But just from what we had to what we had now, it has changed drastically, and it is amazing. Like, if we had this when the game first came out, I think the hate would be a lot different because the game is so much more enjoyable now than what it was. Obviously, I love the game, so I'm going to play it no matter what. But, I mean, I've had a ton of people and know a ton of people that have came back just to play the game and just enjoy it now and just say, like, yeah, the game is a lot better than what it was, like... Obviously, you know, we're, we're not going to deny, like, hey, like, season zero, season one, they were cool for its time, but, like, they are just not good. They're not good seasons. And the outfits, skins were just not good. Um, the content Rock City was releasing is not good. And another thing, too, like, I hope season four expands upon and just keeps, like, in the game is keep the Brainiac boss fight short and expand upon strongholds. And maybe, just maybe, Rock City before the game comes to an end in season maybe just give us one raid in season four because i'm y'all been teasing raids but i'm pretty sure we haven't even really gotten one and i know too y'all brought it up in the developer update last year in january you said you guys would release new weapons like or new weapon types still waiting for that obviously we'll have to see as we know, a lot of the stuff that was originally planned has been cut, and, you know, that's okay. But I'm just here to say, like, hey, I think Season 4 is going to be a blast. And obviously, like, if you guys want to try out the game, you know, I would recommend it. I, I'm not going to say, like, this is the perfect game, but if you like looter shooters and if you like DC, like, it's the perfect match. So that's, that's where I stand. Anyways, though, this is Pineapple Sway. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do you guys look forward to season four? I can say I do because obviously Batman is returning. And, you know, I just I look forward to seeing how this game ends. Um, it's been a great journey, you know, being a content creator for this game and just seeing, like, how it's kind of paced out. Obviously, hasn't gone the way that I initially thought or expected. But, you know, it's always cool to just see, like, to get a proper ending. Even if or, we, we, we may not get a proper ending. I don't know, but we'll see. Anyways, like what I said, it's Pineapple Sway. Love you guys. Thanks for all the support. Peace out.